Welcome to the Iron Ridge Outdoors channel. I've been working hard processing wood around the property. I've got the fun job now of chopping it up. Uh, but I went to a local estate sale and while I was there they had a big old free bin. Check out this out. It's like an old hickory style knife. I don't know if it actually is the old hickory brand but it's definitely a high carbon steel. It is like paper thin steel. And this type of knife with that thin of a blade not really quite what I'd be looking for and I thought what could I do with this so I think what I'm gonna do is make a a fillet knife for fishing this type of blade would really work well in that application it's it's really flexible and so I think I'm just gonna get on the grinder and kinda of profile it out put a new edge on it won't take anything I'll probably do more of a uh, convex slack grind using the slack of the belt to give it a nice edge I don't know if I'm, I'm tempted to put a new handle on it but I think what I'm gonna do is just kinda clean up this handle just so it's a nice small project but that's on the agenda for today let's get to it now the other thing that I don't want to do with this knife is do another heat treat on it uh, in a coal forge with a, a knife this long and this thin uh, melting it and overheating the seal would be extremely easy so I'm just gonna take it nice and easy dunk it in the water as I go to uh, not overwork the metal that way I will not have to reheat treat it and it saves a lot of time off this project oh, definitely hard though it's not uh not going away very fast I got my main outline done and I was being judiciously careful to uh, dunk my knife in the water to make sure it kept the blade nice and cool to not ruin the heat treat on it. And I can definitely tell this is hardened steel because I'm not used to grinding hardened steel and it definitely um, took a lot longer than expected. But we're there now and all there is now is to sharpen the blade, make it look pretty and rework this handle and put a little bit of a, a finger cut out right here just for a little bit more comfort and just to change it up. Here we go. Well, hot damn! That just went from ugly to... Well, I'm not gonna lie, it's still pretty ugly. <laughs> but, it's functional now. And uh, this will make a pretty decent little fillet knife. I'm gonna sharp it up here on the stone, and then we'll call it a day. I'm not even gonna put anything on the handle, because it's already starting to separate, and I'm not gonna worry about it. Another thing I found at this estate sale, for free, is this sweet hammer. 
Um, you can see it's uh, had seen better days. The handle is completely spent. So I'll get a new handle for that, clean it up, and I got a nice pound hammer. Super excited about that. I know who ER is. Maybe uh, he got sent to the ER. So he whacked himself with it. <laughs> I don't know. That was corny. But thanks for watching, guys. Take care.